Hey everybody, it's I Want to Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at installing Web Issues, a bug and enhancement tracker on Linux. To get started, launch the terminal and run sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade to install any available software updates. Then we'll use apt install to install the Apache web server and MariaDB database backend, followed by another apt install to install PHP and the required PHP modules. Next, we'll elevate to root using sudo su and execute the MySQL secure installation script. Follow the prompts to set a MySQL root password and mitigate known vulnerabilities. Once completed, we'll log into the MySQL database as the root user using the password we just set. Then using SQL commands, we'll create a web issues database and create a web issues service account with full permissions to the new database. Then we'll flush MySQL privileges, exit the MySQL prompt, and exit the elevated root prompt. Now we'll download the latest web issues source code using wgit. We'll extract the downloaded tar file to the web root, rename the extracted folder to web issues, removing the version number, then set ownership on the new folder to the www data group. And finally, we'll restart the Apache 2 service. Open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the host slash web issues. Click the configure database link. Select your language and click Next. Scroll down to the Connection Details section, and using the video description, complete the MySQL database configuration. On the Server Configuration form, enter a server name, then enter and confirm a password for the admin user. And optionally, provide an email address for the admin account. On the Confirm Installation page, click the Install button. Once the install completes successfully, click the Web Client link. Welcome to Web Issues, running on your Linux device.